love yourself, find a way to love yourself. Um, you might find this difficult if you have a lot of those internal voices where I can't do this, I don't know how to do this, I won't do this, um, I'm not able, I'm not worthy, I'm not valuable enough to do this. And I would hate to hear any young female to say that about herself because she can and she is valuable and she is worthy. An extension of that is your ability to love yourself also impacts your ability to love the people around you. Um, whether that's your family or whether that's your classmates or whether that's someone that you would find that's very difficult to love. Um, love conquers all things. It covers over a multitude of sins, right? So it's going to be the thing that holds communities together. It's going to be the thing that holds families together. It's going to be the thing that um, will be your mo main motivation in the end. The final thing that I would encourage young women, uh, besides loving themselves and loving their community around them, is to find an ideal to love, whether that's to love justice or to love peace. I was motivated when I was very young um, because I, I would see, I actually saw bullies in my middle school and I was motivated by my love for justice and my love for setting something right um, to stand up to those bullies. Um, if you can find something like that that you love to do, it doesn't have to be justice, it can be something else. Um, life is so worth living if you can love yourself and love your community um, and find something that you love doing.